I was wrong. I was wrong about the Air Assault game mode and also about many other things. Guys, today I just want to talk and go through all of the things that I've been wrong with. Actually, yes, I was wrong. And one of them being the Air Assault game mode. I know I've released a video saying we don't want it or something along those lines. This was my clickbait, but I admit I was totally wrong with this video. I don't want to act like I'm trying to say that it's not my fault, because obviously yes, it is my fault, I made a video, I posted it, but I just want to show you my perspective and why I basically decided to go for such opinion in this video. Because I do know that it's a completely different story if you compare the viewer's perspective on the receiving side to the creator's perspective on the creation side, not sure how to call it. For me, everything about doing YouTube comes down to your engagement, guys. The views, likes, comments, because naturally, I'm not big yet and I want to get more views to then get more subscribers to then be bigger and in the end grow my channel. I know some of you might say that if I get more views, that means I get more money. But in my case, at such low views and subscribers amount, I barely get 100 bucks a month. It's really not that much, considering how much hours I have to put in to actually create all those videos. The point is, I'm always trying to be first, whether this is a new update, news or DLC release to the CTE. I want to cover it first because, naturally, if I do it first, I get more views and I grow faster. Sometimes I won't be the first one. Game changers get exclusive sessions where they can capture footage of the new maps before they even go live on the CTE. They have access to various different information before they go public, and that's fine. But when I can, I'm trying to always be the first one. And this is what pretty much lost me with the Air Assault video. My initial impression was that it's nothing special. It's not good. And then, when it came out to the vanilla game, got released with the Apocalypse DLC, I played it for a while and it turned out to be good. It was fun. Of course, I still think that it has a couple of problems that could be fixed or could be done differently, but I'm not saying that the game mode is so terrible. It's fun. As I said, at first I thought it wasn't because I just had a negative first impression. But then I realized, after taking a step back and getting a bigger perspective of the whole thing, that if I reach so many thousands of people with this video, then those people might not even try out the game mode because I've already said that it's not good. And this was totally not my intention. And at this point, I realized how much of an impact I actually can have on people and all of the influencers can have on someone if they release a video, they say certain thing in their tweet or post, like, this is massive. Even if you only have 6000 of subscribers like I do, you can still affect people. And I didn't realize it until then. Now, do I want to remove the previous video about Air Assault? No, I'm not gonna remove it unless I really feel like I should do it, but at the moment I don't. I want all of the content that I created to stay on the channel, at least for now. Because when the new people come and they want to see the progress, they can actually see it. They can see all of the mistakes, they can see all of the things I've tried and some of them worked, some of them didn't, but I still went from those couple of views per videos to couple of thousands of views, which I find to be a great progress. Anyway guys, that would be it for this video. As I've said, I messed up and I felt like I should record a follow-up video to explain the whole thing. As always, if you enjoyed, remember to leave a like, subscribe and I see you on the battlefield!